Everyone, this is Luxcon coming at you with another budget commander. Um, I've yet to play test this deck, but um, in theory, I think it's going to be very fun to play. So let's free the commander. So her name is Kadira, and she's three mana, Selesna, and it says uh, she's a three three with trample. And whenever she deals combat damage to a player, for each token you control, create a 1-1 one, one white rabbit creature token. So this is important in our deck because um, we have a lot of token generation. But first, let's talk about the ramp. So we have the elves. Uh, we have Landward Elf, and we have uh, Gilded Goose, and we also have... Um, what's the other one? Uh... Yeah, but whatever. Uh, which allows you to ramp. Then we're playing creatures uh, that um, give us additional creatures. So the queen gives us another token creature. And her power and toughness is equal to the number of creatures we control. Um, we have Rumor Gatherer for draw. We have Welcoming Vampire for draw. Uh, Tireless Tracker allows us to um, investigate and whenever we sack a clue, we put a 1-1 one, one counter on her. Then we also have the Tireless Provisioner, which uh, when I land ETBs, you can create a food or a treasure, which allows us to ramp. Torrens allows us to generate uh, tokens every time we cast a creature spell. Then we have the Ramp and Cultivate, Far Seek, Kodama's Reach, Many Partings, Rampant Growth, um... And that's it. And then we also play the harvest season, so uh, we can get a ton of lands uh, to our battlefield uh, based on the fact that we're going to have a lot of uh, tap token creatures that are attacking. For draw, we're going to be playing harmonize. And then we also have a removal spell, an hour of reckoning, uh, which will destroy all non-token creatures, and it has convoke. And then we're playing ton of instant spells we got 17 we have removal protection uh token generation uh land ramp um i'm not sure if i just said draw but some draw effects and uh protection spells in cameo safekeeping and tie bar stand and then for artifacts we are running arcane signet commander sphere mind stone celestia signet soul ring Swift Boots for Protection and Throne of the God Feral for damage. And then for enchantments, uh, Inspiring Leader, which gives our tokens plus two, plus two. Tamble Virtue gives them plus one, plus one of Vigilance. Uh, we have Rabble Rousing to play a card for free and make a ton of tokens. And then we have Tosca's Welcome as another draw effect. And then our land base is pretty simple. Beautiful Pomenade, Cabaretti Courtyard, Tassin Ardenvale, Moss Work Bridge for free stuff, and with Windsprick Heights for, for free stuff. And uh, that's about it. So we curve out around three. So turn three, we're, we're pumping, we're good. And um, there seems to be an even split between green and white, um, and 11% colorless. And then this deck is going to cost you about 100 to 110. So I hope you enjoyed this deck tech. The video will be on YouTube later. Um, you can see the link to the Mox field. And if you can subscribe to my channel, that would be great. But you do not have to. And I hope you have a wonderful day.